Hello, YouTube. It's been a while. Today, we'll just be doing Futa Shwen Ho Ho summon session and maybe leveling and putting gear on her, yeah? Seems nice and comfy. All right. <coughs> Wait, I haven't checked my pity. I'm pretty sure I, my pities are usually really low. I usually do like single summons when I'm close to like a five star or something. Hala. Get E1. I think I'm good. I think I'll just stick with like E0 characters. I think that's fun. Yeah, I'm at like exactly zero. E0 more relatable. Listen, even if I go E0 free to play light code, everyone is just gonna be like XDD code, your relic. It's Hokage. I don't need any of the four star here, right? I get like a copy of Lynx at least. E1 is massive. Yeah, but it's not necessary. I don't need it. It's cool to have, but you don't need it. <laughs> Hokage again. No Lynx? Yeah, maybe it's gonna be a no Lynx run. What's our crit rate buff? There's a crit rate buff scale with Talon. I keep getting Hokage. Oh god. What's the max? 4%? Yeah, that's fine. 10% at level 8? Okay. Honestly, I don't mind losing 50-50, so I have more chance to get more links and more Eidolon. Jesus Christ, I keep getting Hook. Can I start getting links now? Hook is plaguing this manner, truly. I feel like usually other 4 star starts to get hated just because, you know, they keep appearing while the new 4 star doesn't appear, you know? <sighs> oh yeah, it's Lynx. One copy. Lynx Eidolon is kinda nasty, right? That's your one and only copy, code. That's not gonna be my one and only copy. Alright, make me lose 50-50. I wanna have a reason to pull more Lynx. Come on. I think one copy of Lynx is enough. I'll get Lynx in future banner, maybe. Let me level her up. I'm pretty sure I prepped enough resource. This is a low energy uh, pull session because I'm still fucking sick. I'm still exhausted. I do have gear, right? I have the gear on my Piranha or something. Piranha, give me the gear. And let me level up Traces. I want to get the effect resistance nodes. Do I have any of the uh, XDD box? I have a little bit. Light cone. Let's put this in for now. I'm missing 18% HP. I don't like 89.9 though. That number tilt me. I have 1.8k defense still. That's good. Should be around like 6,000 health, 1.8k defense, 144 speed, max regen, and 90 resist. Should I like use the Herta store one? Lando's choice is decent. Lando's ass. <laughs> what? 65, 35 damage split? This light cone applies twice on the 65 portion and on the 35 portion. So this is better, no? It also double applies on like your allies as well, no? Landos is good for HP roll. You go from your team getting hit like 60% of the time to 40. It's not gonna affect your ER that drastically. <laughs> You're still getting hit by AoEs anyways. I feel like people are overestimating how OP Landos choice is. HP is so low, I don't have any choices. I should be fine. I'll just get some traces. Uh, what the fuck do I want to run? I just put her in there? That serves zero purpose if I put her in there. I should probably like grab a herda. The undying team? That would be double destruction. Double destruction. I probably like Blade, Lara, Lucha, Fu, Shren is pretty fucking unkillable. Like that is, that should be pretty unkillable. Defense down or damage resistance down will kill you fast. Yeah, because Fushun only resists crowd control, right? It's only crowd control, right? Isn't crit rate buff kind of useless from? Pretty sure crit rate buff is kind of redundant on the, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of redundant. Time to say bye. Why does she get crit rate as a stat? Why does Weld have effect resistance instead of effect hit rate as a stat? Why does Asta get fucking crit rate? I don't fucking know. At some point, you're like, yeah, whatever. Like, it's so ass. Every Nihility character gets effect hit rate as a stat. Weld fucking gets effect resistance. Why? This feels like a waste to activate. Oh my god. Where's the XDD? 
When fusion fuels on a battle, all allies takes 14% less damage. Okay. I feel like I kind of want to go for passive first. Yeah, why am I even leveling the other shit? Bro, it's just talent and skill. These are absolute garbage to level. What the fuck am I doing? 15 DR. Fire MC gives you 15 DR when she press E, but that's only for like one turn. This shit lasts three, right? That's stupid. That's dumb. Oh my god. 20 DR at max? Is that like 3,000? Some shit defense? <laughs> that's dumb. That's something dumb. I think it's fine. Level 10 trace. Level 10 talent plus day one is 30% DR on top of the damage conversion already, right? So as far as I know, the damage split the 65-35 also reduce if you have DR, right? But I'm basically taking like zero damage. So it's 30% DR on top of defense, right? I have like 1,800 defense. Jesus Christ. Wait, am I fucking healing set? <laughs> oh, that is bad. <laughs> I think it's fine. It's usable. This is a decent stat line, to be honest. 6,000 health, 1,800 defense, 144 speed, maximum regen, and 90 effect resistance. Yeah, relatable stats. If I have traces at level 10, that'll be 30% damage reduction at all times for my entire team. Also, I'll take 30% less damage from the damage distribution as well, right? That should be fine. Should I do like a quick run somewhere? MOC. Okay, sure. So do I just like drop Natasha and put in a Futa Shuan. Okay, you want me to auto with Fu Shuan and Marsh? Yeah, I don't think they die. At the same time, I don't think I do damage. But I think it's fine, right? I'll use this, this, and then this, and then that, okay? Surely they'll auto, right? <laughs> MC is not needed, but it's not fun! If you don't beat the game with a fucking cracked physical MC, what's the point, you know? What's the point? <laughs> Two preservation? It's two preservation, two destruction. This team does zero damage. Okay, my damage is from breaking enemy shield. Like, the only damage I do is when MC fucking breaks someone. What's the point of this showcase? Like, how do you even fucking showcase Fu Xuan? Like, do you just like, okay, so your team doesn't die. But like, I'm running double destruction because like, this is like a physical weakness enemy in MOC 10. Classic Cold doesn't know what the fuck he's doing for showcases. I don't know how, but whenever I do a character showcase, another character always ends up stealing the show. I'm really bad at this. Every single time I do a character showcase, someone else steals the show. <laughs> DPS Fu Xuan. Ah, it ain't worth it. This team doesn't even fucking use skill points. This team doesn't even use skill points, and Marsh is just shitting on her right now. You see her damage me? I don't see the damage. I feel like the squishiest one on my team is Physical MC. Physical MC is like the squishiest one on my team. That's like 100 damage from that Gleave. 100 damage from that poke? Marsh is doing work. <laughs> Marsh is doing a lot of work. This is just a classic March showcase. God damn it. I don't think my Fu Xuan passive activated yet. She shielded all four people. All four teammates has a shield. All, all four teammates has a shield. March! Stop! <laughs> Kinda counterpick Galara with this March. My March effect hit rate is too high. It's counterpicking my Galara, exactly. I can feel zero damage coming out right now. Oh, that was bad. MC should have hit the the big guy, because Mars doesn't have break effect. Oh, she finally flipped! So it's perma uptime, right? Fu Xuan auto battle has no downside, right? I mean, obviously, she'll still old a 1 HP enemy. But like, Fu Xuan auto battle is E basic basic, right? And 2 stack again. Okay, what? Should I try to Fu Xuan solo sustain or something? Maybe that's better. Okay, MC bonk him. Rules! <laughs> oh, she's dead to Clara, I think. She flips! I mean, I autoed it with, like, the same team, but instead of Fushuan and with Natasha, right? Because MOC doesn't really, like, it doesn't feel hard <laughs> anymore. Even with, like, E0 five stars and shit. 
It's kind of XDD. Is Full Shred good? Yeah, I think Full Shred is good, guys. That was a perfect Full Shred showcase, right? So my build is only 6,000 health, 1,800 defense, 144 speed, maximum regen, and 90 effect resistance. And I'm using a four-star light cone. That's good, right? Smile. I'm using healing bonus set for some fucking reason. Marsh showcase. Yeah, so the Marsh build is 3,000 defense, 153 speed, maximum regen, and 140 hit rate. Very relatable, yes? I love my relatable builds. All right. Until next time, you guys can mold in the comments again. Shit on me, please. That's not a kink. Don't do it.